and uh, I'm live, and this is uh, the Sean Killian Movies uh, podcast and my uh, predictions for the uh, 95th Academy Awards, which are happening uh, this uh, Sunday. So uh, this is a new experience for me of trying a live podcast for the first time in a while to uh, give my uh Predictions for the Oscars, I, I'm just going to stick with the major categories because I don't want to be here all night. <laughs> so I'm uh, going to bring up my slideshow for the people watching the video. And uh, here are my uh, predictions for the Academy Awards. And we'll start with... Um, best Documentary Feature. So the uh, nominees are All That Breathes, A House Made of Splinters, Fire of Love, The Lady, and All the Beauty and the Bloodshed. So um, I've only actually seen uh, two of these nominees. I've been hoping to catch up with um, more, and I might still watch uh, Fire of Love, which I want to see, but I am going to say that my uh, prediction uh, for Best Documentary Feature, uh, which I uh, was one of the documentaries that I did see earlier this week, it will be All the Beauty and the Bloodshed, which I predict uh, will win uh, Best Documentary Feature, and um, that's from the uh, director of System 4, and that won the Best Documentary Award uh, a few years ago. So uh, my uh, next uh, category is uh, Best International Feature, and the uh, nominees are All Quiet on the Western Front, EO, Close, Argentina 1985, and The Quiet Girl. And uh, I have seen two of these nominees, uh, All Quiet on the Western Front and The Quiet Girl, and I am going to make the prediction that All Quiet on the Western Front will win the Oscar for Best International Feature. So, uh, moving onwards is Best Animated Feature. And the nominees are Guillermo del Toro's Pinocchio, Marcelo the Shell with Shoes On, Puss in Boots The Last Wish, The Sea Beast, and the Toronto set Pixar film, Turning Red, which I'm still kicking myself that I haven't seen it yet. I uh, wish that played in theaters and uh, haven't had time to watch it on uh, Disney+. Plus. Or, uh, uh, usually um, we can call um, Best Animated Feature the Disney Pixar Award, and uh, I still think that Turning Red has a good chance of winning but um, based on some of the uh, pre-Oscar awards, I am going to say that Guillermo del Toro's Pinocchio will win Best Animated Feature. Okay, so next up we have Best Adapted Screenplay, and that goes to All Quiet on the Western Front, Glass Onion, The Good Lives Out Mystery, Living, Top Gun Maverick, and Woman Talking. So I'm going to say that Best Adapted Screenplay will go to a Canadian because Woman Talking is my prediction for Best Adapted Screenplay, and hopefully Sarah Polly will become an Oscar winner. Okay, moving on, we have Best Original Screenplay for the um, Banshees of... In a Shrin, Everything Everywhere All At Once, Triangle of Samus, The Fablemans, and Tar. And I'm going to say that the best original screenplay will go to a, war, a film that will probably win a lot of awards at the Oscars this year, Everything Everywhere All At Once. So now for the um, 
Best Supporting Actress nominees. We have Angela Bassett for Black Panther Wakanda Forever, Hong Chow for The Whale, Carrie Condon for The Banshees of Venice Ren, Jamie Lee Curtis for Everything Everywhere All at Once, and Stephanie Su also for Everything Everywhere All at Once. So um, I think at one point it was thought that um, Angela Bassett would uh, win the award for this. Uh, but I am going to go with the winner of the um, Screen Actors Guild, and that would be Jamie Lee Curtis winning Best Supporting Actress. So uh, moving on, we have Best Supporting Actor. That's um, Brendan Gleeson for The Banshees of Inishrin, Brian Tyree Henry for Causeway, Kei Hua Kwan for Everything Everywhere All at Once, Judd Hirsch for The Fablemans, Barry Keegan for The Banshees of Inishrin. So uh, the guy who has been winning all of the awards for this category is probably going to win the Oscar. The former short round himself, Kei Hui Kwan, will win Best Supporting Actor for Everything Everywhere All at Once. And um, this is going to be a uh, pattern in my predictions, if you can wait. Moving on. Best Actress. We have Kate Blanchett for Tar, Anna Diarmas for Blonde, Michelle Yeoh for Everything Everywhere All at Once, Andrea Riceborough for Two Leslie, and Michelle Williams for The Fablemans. So I first want to take a minute to talk about the controversial nomination for um, Andrea Riceborough for Two Leslie, which I uh, watched uh, earlier this week, and I can say that the award, wa the nomination was uh, warranted. Um, I think um, just because it was a small independent film that literally came out of nowhere, I think it was a grassroots campaign that uh, got the nomination. But um, it'll just be a nomination because my prediction for Best Actress will be Michelle Yeoh from Everything Everywhere All at Once. Uh, there's going to be a lot more predictions for that film. <laughs> so moving on, we have Best Actor. So um, Austin Butler for Elvis, Colin Farrell for The Banshees of Inish Rin, Bill Nye for Living, Brendan Fraser for The Whale, and Paul Mescal for After Sun. So I am going to to probably go with the uh, popular pick and make my prediction for Brendan Fraser for The Whale. Even though um, there's still a slight chance that Austin Butler may spoil the award and win instead. So uh, next up, we have Best Director. So we have Martin McDonough for The Bianches of Venturin, Daniel Kwan and Daniel Stewart, better known as Daniels for Everything Everywhere All at Once, Ruben Ostland for The Triangle of Sadness, Steven Spielberg for The Fablemans, and Todd Field for Tar, his first feature in about two decades. So, this is an easy prediction. I like all of mine. My prediction for Best Director is Daniel Kwan and Daniel Schneidhardt for everything, everywhere, all at once. And do I really have to do the last one? Best picture? All Quiet on Western Front. Everything, everywhere, all at once. The Banshees of Inisherin. Elvis. Woman Talking. Top Gun the Maverick. Tar. Trying of Sanus. Avatar, The Way of Water. And The Fablemans. And, and we're going to make my uh, prediction for Best Picture, Everything Everywhere All at Once. So I'm pretty much predicting a uh, sweep for this film. And um, so um, 
I don't, I'm going to probably go look through some of the um, other categories and see what I think might win, but I'm not going to make a formal prediction. So uh, we're fascinated in the photography, and the nominees here are All Quiet on West Front, uh, Bardo, False Chronicle of the Handful of Truth, Elvis, Empire of Light, and Tar. Um, you can't go wrong with Roger Deakins. So I am going to say that uh, cinematography will probably go to uh, Empire of Light. So uh, costume design. We have here Babylon, Panther, Wakanda, Elvis, Everything and Miss Harris to Paris. Um, I think it's a flip between Babylon, Black Panther, and Everything Everywhere All at Once. Uh, I'm not going to make a formal prediction. I need to think about that for a few more days. So uh, then uh, we have a uh, documentary short film. So uh, one of these are The Elephant Whispers, Haul Out, How Do You Measure a Year, uh, The Martha Mitchell Effect. Stranger at the Gate. Um, so I uh, actually saw the documentary shorts a few weeks ago. And uh, the ones that stood out for me are The Elephant Whispers, How Do You Measure a Year, and uh, Stranger at the Gate. So I'm going to say it would be one of those three that wins. I will make my final prediction in a few days. I'm not sure. So film, okay, so film editing. We have Banshees, Adventure In, Elvis, Everything Everywhere All at Once, Tar, and Top Gun Maverick. Everything Everywhere All at Once has to win Best Editing because that film is pretty much all about the editing. So um, moving on to makeup and hairstyling. So we have All Quiet on Western Front, The Batman, Black Panther, Wakanda Forever, Elvis, and The Whale. I'm going to say The Whale wins for uh, Brendan Fraser's Fat Suit. So, I mean, music, original score, uh, applause, hold my, oh, original song. So, applause from Tell Like a Woman, Hold My Hand from Tom Grimm Maverick, Lift Me Up from Black Panther, Rock on the Fever, Natu Natu from RRR, and This Is Life from Everything Everywhere All at Once. I am going to say that I hope Natu Natu wins this because RRR deserved a lot more nominations than just the one it got. So uh, now we have production design, All Quiet on Western Front, Avatar The Way of Water, Babylon, Elvis, and The Fablemans. I am going to say that Babylon will get production design. So short film animated. The Boy, The Mo, The Fox, and The Horse, The Flying Sailor, a Canadian film, Ice Merchants, My Year of Dicks, a uh, very <laughs> sexually charge film, uh, kind of comedy, and an ostrich told me the world is fake, and I think I believe it. So I really like the ostrich told me the world is fake, and I think I believe it, and the boy, the boy, the fox, and the horse, which uh, I think the boy, the boy, the fox, and the horse probably win this one. Okay, so next we have short film, live action, an Irish goodbye, Idolu, the pupil, night ride, and the red suitcase. So I want to say it's going to be for Irish Goodbye, the Pupel, or the Red Suitcase. Sound. Mummies are all quite on the rest in front. Avatar to Way of Water, the Batman, Elvis, and Top Gun Maverick. I am going to say Top Gun Maverick will get the saucer. Visual effects. All quite on the rest in front. Avatar to Way of Water, the Batman. Black Panther, Wakanda Fever, and Top Gun Maverick. I'm going to say Avatar The Way of Water will get this. And yeah, that's all the categories. So uh, the uh, Oscars are on uh, this Sunday. I am going to be uh, watching them uh, theatrically at the Hot Dogs Ted Rogers Cinema. And uh, I think that's it for my... Uh, Oscars Prediction Podcast, and I will see you next time. The Sean Kelly on Movies Podcast is a production of SKMovies.com. 
episodes and show notes can be found at skmoviespodcast.ca and you can subscribe to us via Spotify, Apple Podcasts, Google Podcasts, and where else podcasts are hosted. Support us by joining our Patreon at patreon.com slash skmovies.